What's going on everybody, it's my Paul Bear. Thank you all so much for checking out another video. And what I've got for you today is how you can get aimbot as in the settings in Modern Warfare 2. It's ridiculous, it's overpowered, it's in the game, I don't... It's hard to say that you don't advise using something like this when it makes the game so much easier and it's readily available. And like I said, the developers put it in the game, so you may as well abuse it until it gets patched. So, to help me with this, i got my bromosexual life partner, Sneaky! There he is. Who you can't actually hear because the party settings between <coughs> Xbox and PlayStation are just ass. And in, for this situation... We are just, you know, we're just star-crossed lovers. We're staring at each other from across the fence. A romance that could be, never be fulfilled. Anyway, so let's crack on straight on with it. Also, by the way, if this helps you out, likes help me out. So get slapping if you're going to use this. Right then. So, Sneaky, can you just do me if you stand here? Okay, so this is a standard auto-aim. <clears throat> if you can move from left to right for me. Not a great deal happens if I lock on. You get a little bit of tug either way, and I haven't touched the right stick. Just that initial tug in the beginning. And, yeah, that's kind of all you get. You get a little bit of assistance. It pulls you a little bit. And that is on your standard settings. If you go to controller, go over to the advanced tab, and then go on your aim assist type. This is what you will have by default. You'll have default and standard. But if you want something a lot more useful shall we say you go from click on that and you go down to black ops and then from standard you go to dynamic and sneaky if you would do me the honors can you start moving around for me yeah you can see how hard that grips and i'm not touching the right stick it is absurd if he just comes into view it just immediately just starts tracking it's cr oh my god! It's crazy how good that is, and it just—it's ridiculous, and it it shoots up straight for the head as well. Honestly, it's crazy. It's—I'll get sneaky on the other side of it for him if he can come meet me back in the middle. And I'm hoping he's now switched his settings so you you can kind of prove that I'm not full of nonsense. So sneaks. Right. So. Basically, what Sneaky's got now is he's on this standard default set in it, and I'm moving from left to right, and it's probably pulling me a little bit. And now if he goes into his settings, goes down to controller, goes over to the advanced tab, goes to aim assist type, and puts that onto black ops, and the aim response curve down to dynamic... Yep, and now you lock on me, and look how much that pulls you in. Oh, that's mental. Isn't that crazy, dude? Literally, it's watching him walk away. I'm not touching the right stick, and it's just following him. If I just nudge it in the direction, it just locks. It's absurd. It works stupidly well. It's stupidly overpowered. And until it gets patched, look, yeah, it's, it's a bit of a... What's the nicest way to put this? It's a bit of a bastard. But they put it in the game for a reason, so whilst it's there, have at it. 